I'm going to spend the day with my grandfather today. Um, yesterday was his birthday. I get really, really bad. Like, I'm like shaky. So if this camera is shaky, I'm sorry. It's because I'm holding it. Um, I get really, really bad anxiety when I have to drive on the interstate because I was in a really bad car accident. Wow. Um, 10-6-07 was my was my car accident. Today's 10-4, um, 2017. So in two days, it'll be 10 years um, since that accident happened. And um, wow, <laughs> I'm sorry that I didn't think I was gonna get emotional. I didn't even think about it. Like, oh wow. I should have died. It's such a crazy story. Like, the doctor that put me back together, like, doesn't even fucking exist. Like, I went to go get, like, my staples and stuff removed, and they're like, yeah, what doctor? What are you talking about? Like, this doctor, we don't have a doctor by this name. This guy doesn't exist. And I was like, what the fuck are you talking about? Like, my paperwork has his name on it. Anyways, it doesn't matter. It's a long story. So, I want to go see my grandfather. He's not doing the best with his health right now. Um, his kidneys are doing not good. Um, so I want to spend as much time with him as humanly possible. Uh, with that being said, I get super bad anxiety with driving. I don't even remember. I'm like, my mind is such a clusterfuck. It's all over the place right now. I'm having like such bad fucking anxiety. <sighs> um... I want to spend as much time with my grandfather as I can while he's here. So I'm going to suck up the fact that I'm terrified of this fucking drive. And I'm just going to fucking do it. I'm looking for my shoes. My shoes are over here in the living room. Of course they are. I love you. I wish you could go, but we're going to go to lunch and then you won't have anywhere to go you won't be allowed in the restaurant so i think mommy's gonna eat a banana do you want i think this is what we have to change it to let's change the tv for you okay oh this poor little lizard i feel so bad he was on my car can you see him he was on my car before i left the house and i tried to skadoodle him away but he wouldn't skadoodle away and now we're doing 47 miles an hour and he's holding on for dear life. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna get on the interstate. Like it's gonna get even worse for his little poor little life. I don't know. All right, I'm gonna pull over. I gotta save this lizard. I can't, I can't let him just die. Like, keep going. Jump, 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 jump off. Jump, it's okay, it's okay. Do you wanna get on this card? Ah! Keep going, keep going, keep going, jump, 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 yes, yes, good job, good job, be free. Okay, I'm sorry, I don't know, your family's probably back at my house, I'm really, really sorry, but at least now you're free. I'm, I'm sorry that you had a roller coaster ride, and you're not even going to be able to tell any of your friends or family because you're so far away from home, and I don't know how you'll ever find your way back, but at least you're alive. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry I couldn't get you off sooner. I'm so sorry. Have a good day, Mr. Lizard. Okay, bye-bye. Okay, I'm calling my papa. Hey there. Hey, papa. I just wanted to let you know that I'm almost to, um, I guess that's Gibsonton or Riverview. I just went through the port of Tampa. Oh, okay. Okay, so I'm not very far. Alright. Okay? Alright. I'll see you soon. Alright. Okay, I'll love you. Okay, love you. You too. Bye. Okay. That's something that um, I feel is important. Like, if you're, like, running late at all or if you're supposed to be meeting somebody, like, it is so important to, like, touch base with them and let them know where you're at. Seriously. Like... I'm trying to get to my damn grandfather. I'm already running late, and now there's a fucking train. What the hell?
Oh, and it's going so super slow. Oh my. As if it wasn't bad enough already that I was running late. I hope this train is really short because I already called my grandfather. I feel so bad. I told him I would be here by 12 o'clock. It's now 12.16. He's waiting on me to eat. Like, I feel like such a fucking asshole. Like, mm, sucks. There's nothing I can do. I mean, there's nothing I can do about a train except for wait, you know? So, guess that's what I'll do. So slow. Oh, now it's coming to a stop. Hmm. I'm stuck at a train. Okay, they're done. There's the guy on the back of the train. Bye bye. Um, you're everywhere you're supposed to be when you're supposed to be there. Like me catching this train, like yes, maybe it held me up a couple of minutes, but what if I didn't catch this train and I was up the street a couple of minutes and then I got hit by another car? Do you know what I mean? Like this train may have just prevented me from being in a car accident. You never know, you know what I'm saying? Like that's what I mean by, oh, ooh. I tried to drive my car while it was in fucking park. I forgot I put it in park. Oops. If you want Chinese, we will do Chinese. Do you want me to go pick it up for us? Oh, I'll take you. You can go in and get it, but I'll drive it. I lost a bunch of shingles, but that, that didn't surprise me because I needed a new roof anyhow. Uh, yeah. Uh, but I got a new roof right after the... Right after the hurricane? Yeah, I, real quick. Really? I, I was lucky, lucky. The guys across the street wants, wants the same guy to do his. It's going to take him three weeks to get his done. Got three doors down wants his done. I don't know how long it'll take him to get it. You got yours but, done right away. Yeah, they come in about noon one day, and I, the next day they were finished. Oh, that's good. Yeah. How much was it? $9,000. Oh, my God. Did they do the whole roof? Hmm? They, they did the whole roof? Oh, yeah. They oh, that's a good deal. Off. They took it all off. That's a good deal. For a whole brand new roof, that's a good deal. Yeah. I think it was pretty. It's got 50-year uh, shingles on it. Good. It's shingles supposed to last 50 years, and it's guaranteed 130 mile an hour wind. Oh, good. That means you'll have to wait another 50 years to see if it withstands that wind. So you're going to have to hang on another 50 years. Yeah. That, and also, <laughs> another good thing about it is, is I, the, the first person, if I sell this house to somebody, the guarantee also goes to them. Oh, good. That's good. But only one time. Like he told me that they replaced 10 sheets of plywood on my house. Oh, wow. So, the plywood is only half inch thick. Yeah. And uh, he charged me $25 a sheet so for extra. I think that you get four that's included in the original price, but anything that over four, why well, they charge you. He only charged me $25 extra for That's nice. To put it down, I mean, to, to put the, you know, him getting the plywood and putting it down, it's worth $25. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so uh, he told me that they replaced 10, 10 sheets. How did you find him? He, he did Gail's roof. Oh. And uh, I was looking for somebody bad, and right now, trying to get somebody to do a roof. You're, you're parking up a tree because everybody's been hurt. Yeah. And we're not hurt nearly as bad as over east of here. I know, yeah. 
My um, I'm waiting. I'm on a wait list to get my trees cut that are broken because Chris can only climb so high to cut them on a ladder, and then we need a higher ladder or a bucket truck or something. So I had them put me on the list, and it's going to be like maybe even six months before they can get to my trees. Yeah. So. Um, it's wet, and and roots don't hold. Yeah. Yeah. What's this uh, with your roof? Is that where it was leaking? That's, yeah, that's, there's a vent there. Oh. And the wind blew so hard, it blew water up into the vent. Oh. See? Yeah. I've never had it happen before, so it, the wind was blowing pretty damn hard. Oh yeah, it was like 100 mile an hour winds or more. Yeah, it was hard. What time did we call the uh, people? We huh? should. What time did we call for our lunch? We should probably go get our lunch. Yeah, we should go get it. You need help getting up, or you got it? Oh, I'm good. Oh, you're like Chris. You you got it? You okay? Mm -hmm. I said, you're like Chris. You just open the wallet and hand me 20s. Yeah. That's how Chris does it. No. <laughs> That's why we get along so good. You're lucky. Yeah, I am, I'm very lucky. Well, look at me. I'm a little cake to my neighbor bought this one. Oh, a cake for your birthday? Yeah, Louis brought it for me. Oh, nice. He still lives next door? The guy next door, he drives a Ferrari or Lamborghini or something. He takes such good care of Papa. He, um, he used to um, have Papa's grass cut for him when he would get his grass cut. He would have the people come cut Papa's grass too. You, got, you need some help? I don't want to get to it. 